Well, hello there. Sometimes, no matter how much you tweak your render settings, materials and light samples, and no matter how long you let the rendering cook, you'll still experience hot pixels and noise in your renderings, just as you see here. Luckily, there's a way we can get rid of this in Photoshop by using a dust and scratch filter, and for reference, here's how it will look afterwards. Let's get started by making a duplicate of our layer. With that selected, go to Filter, Noise and Dust and Scratches. And here you get a dialog with two sliders. We have the radius and we have the threshold. A general advice is to have as low radius as possible and a as high threshold as possible. Check and uncheck the preview button to see how it looks with and without the effect. In this case, the uh, hot pixels are quite tiny, so we can go with a radius of 1. And for the threshold, I think I will go with something around 16. Looks good. Hit OK. And rename the layer to Dust and Scratches. If we take a look at the rendering before the effect, we can see that we have some details down here that get lost in the filter. So also, in general, don't apply this Dust and Scratches filter to the entire image. Just apply it where it's needed. To do that, I hold down Alt or Option and hit the Mask button down here, which will create a black mask for this layer, so now it's not visible at all. Now I can take a brush with a white color and maybe a soft edge. And also I will take the flow down a bit to make it more soft. Now I can paint away the hot pixels where I don't want them to show. And I make sure not to paint over any of the edges and details that I want to keep. So I only paint on the areas where I want the hot pixels to uh, be removed, so to speak. I also have some hot pixels down here. So I take down the brush size to a size where I can paint away the pixels without uh, interfering with any details that I want to keep. And that's how easy it is. Now you just have to paint away the hot pixels and maybe paint in some details again if you by accident covered it up. And you can do that by using a black brush on the mask. Please like and subscribe and all that if uh, you like what you saw. Until next time, take care.